Yo guys, I just woke up and showered. I laid the fit out on the bed. Did any of you guys ever lay out your clothes like this for the first day of school? Or was that just me? I recently got some new hats and I've been trying to incorporate them into my fits. And today I'm rocking with this little camo one. I also have to ask, how are you guys doing? Let me know down below. Like honestly, I love to read all of your guys' comments and also join the Discord server. What's up guys? Yo, here's this camo hat. What do you guys think of it? I think I think it's pretty fire as the watch to the, to the fit, you know? We do got a few things planned today, one of which is fun, one of which is not, and then anything else that happens that isn't planned should be fun. I do plan on going to my storage unit. I have a lot of packages to pick up, kind of be like a ride along and go in a P.O. box with me. On the way to the UPS store. All right, trying to load up the desk first. This is a desk, a little sneak peek, but yeah, trying to load it up in my girlfriend's car. Let's go, everything fit, total of seven packages. Gotta hate being stuck in traffic. home but it's hot as hell i'll be right back i'm back had to change into just uh, i had to change into some shorts hot as hell so you know what that means water break time you knew it was happening everyone everyone hydrate with me right now everyone grab a sip of water oh mm. That was pristine. I said I was gonna do an unboxing, but not today. I literally just got home from the UPS store and just got another notification that I got another package received. And yeah, I kind of figured I didn't have all the packages because I'm noticing some things that should be here. I, I don't see anything, don't worry, I didn't open anything. But from the looks of the boxes, it doesn't look like I have everything. Oh, some time has passed. Life caught up to me, I got busy. I still haven't unboxed the packages, but as you can see, you should kind of my living room is a mess some things have been happening first things first today though i have to do my brakes on my car and then we can go to my p.o box get the rest of my packages and do that unboxing finally so yeah this room got completely emptied the carpet got cleaned because i want to do some stuff to it and i just wanted to make sure it was cleaned but here are all my brake parts uh let's get started all right i got all the parts outside that little cloth you know you gotta wipe stuff down I'm replacing my front rotors and front brake pads, so wish me luck. Guys, here's the old pads. Look how bad this one is. Got the new rotor on, old rotor off. We're almost done with one side. One side done. All right, you know, I'm just doing my thing on the other side here, and look what happened. Don't mind my terminology. I'm not a car guy. All right, I'm just doing my brakes, so sorry if I say the wrong thing. The guide pins are uh, for the caliper, basically, and the bolts here, I was taking them off, and uh, they both snapped inside of these little guide pins. Both of them right there. So I'm gonna try to see if any shop has these around today so I can drive my car. Alrighty, brake job did not go well. Hands dirty, one side done. Other side, those caliper pins, the bolts snapped. And then it's called like a steering knuckle. The bolts inside of that snapped as well. So I have to order that part. I already ordered it. Sadly, it says five to eight business days, so I have to wait another whole week and have people drive me around for another whole week because now I don't have a car because <sighs> time to clean up my hair. Look how crazy it is. And oh, man, no one, no one uh, flamed me for my dirty mirror. But yeah, mirror's kind of dirty. Hair is all whack because it was in a hat all day. Sadly, though, the post office is close today. So I can't even get the rest of my packages and my break job kind of failed. So far, I'm gonna rate my day a solid five out of 10, but I'm gonna take a nice shower and it's gonna be way much better. Sorry for all the background noise. I have a fan on right in front of me, but I totally forgot today was Sunday. Yes, I just got out of the shower kind of a while ago. My hair's already dried, but I forgot today was Sunday. So yeah, that's why the post office was closed. But right now I have been, uh, I started journaling a little bit, you know, it's, it's, it's a nice thing. You guys should definitely start. But my routine, my goals right now, short term, start a routine. It's uh, wash my face, you know, get out of bed, wash my face, brush my teeth, clean my room up, basically uh, make the bed and then journal. And I forgot to make the bed and journal today because right when I woke up, I started my break, my break, uh, my break job. And then tomorrow, I promise you guys, the first thing you'll see is me going to the post office. I promise. Guess where I finally am. Packages secured.
What's up guys, it's a long awaited unboxing. Let's just get right into it. All right, we're gonna start with this little package right here. I have no clue what it is, but let's just rip it open. Let's go. Oh, I remember this. I ordered a, another SD card for uh, just my camera. 64 gigabyte SanDisk SD card. Let's go. All right, this next thing is actually a package I have to return. Um, so yeah, it's just a, just a random thing that I don't need. This one was sent to my P.O. box. Oh, looks like my cats got to it before I did. It's open for me already. Um, I got a box. Oh, okay, what is this? Oh, this is for an upcoming video. That desk setup I was telling you guys about, this is a little thing that mounts to the top of your desk and it's like a power strip. There's two just normal, there are three normal power strips USB A port and a USB type C port. Also, cause why not? Everything I unbox today will be linked down below if you wanna get the same stuff I have for some reason. But yeah, it'll all be linked down below. Next package, <laughs> don't even have to open it up. It's a Vetro V5 CPU cooler. This is gonna be an upcoming PC build. Thank you, Shane is a, uh, Shane, you're epic. You truly are. Everyone uh, thank Shane in the comments, Shane sent me this. Next package. I need the little knife for this one. Oh, it's like that. <gasps> Let's go. All right, this is a little backpack. A brand sent me this. Um, let's do a little first look at it. I'm so excited. I'm actually going on a trip and this is gonna be so nice to take. Let's go. So it's meant for a camera bag. You know, I'm a YouTuber, I have cameras and stuff. Uh, this has a little, a little big, big old compartment in front. It's called the Runner Photo. I might make a video on this, low key. Like in the in the near future, I have to kind of experiment with it. Maybe make like an everyday carry. But oh, super excited! It's in this nice little camo green colorway. Looks really sick. This is probably one of my favorite colors to wear in like clothes. Has a little strap in the back. Hell yeah, I'm excited. All right, let's do a speed unboxing. I got two little packages. Rip one, bam. What is it? Ooh, the, it's a RAM kit, DDR4 3200 megahertz. I think it, yeah, it's from Silicon Power. This is in another up and coming PC build. Once again, thank you, Shane. All right, that wasn't very speedy. I gotta pick up the pace. We got some uh, Asia Horse. Asia horse um, PC power cable thingies, extensions. <laughs> okay, they're just in this nice clean white colorway. White is always good, it literally goes with everything. I also got a little snack with the package. <laughs> Don't eat that. Next package, why does this look like a keyboard? Let's see, I guess. Ouch, don't cut yourself, bro. <laughs> it looks like a lighting product, like RGB stuff. And sorry for this bad camera angle. You guys know this room is a work in progress. We'll have some better camera angles in the near future. This is from Decala. Decala Light Flow. I'm not sure if you how, how you say that brand, but it's basically a big old neon rope light, like that Govi one I have on my gaming setup there. Um, apparently it works with Amazon Alexa and works with Google Assistant. I'm gonna have to definitely experiment with this and maybe use it in the new setup. No need for opening on this one. Um, yeah, it's a, it's a Asus Prime B660 Plus D4. So it's a 12th gen Intel DDR4 motherboard. Like I said, up and coming PC build. Okay, we got this big old package. Let's slice it open. Oh. Oh, these contents are spicy. Let's go. All right. We have an i5-12400F, and it's going to be paired with that Asus Prime motherboard that I was just showing you guys. For some reason, it's not focusing. But yeah, i5-12400F. Super excited. Okay, and then we got a MSI. It's an M.2 SSD, one terabyte, spitanium M470 drive. Come on, bro, focus. There you go, buddy. I think it's fourth gen. Yeah, PCIe 4.0. Read, read speeds up to 5,000 megabytes. Oh my goodness. I'm taking off the hat. Sorry if my hair is whack. I've been wearing hats a lot. This drive is gonna be speedy. Oh! <laughs> Asus, eh, eh, boy, I can't even speak. 
Asus Dual RTX 3060, 12 gigabytes, GDDR6. Oh my goodness, guys. This PC build that's coming up soon, super nice budget banger, brand new PC build. Haven't done one of these in a while and I'm super excited to use these parts. Last and final thing in this big old box. Oh, fuck. I didn't know it was gonna be that big and cover my whole head. Beefcake of a power supply, man. Look at that. It's an Asus one. They make some beautiful units. It's a ROG Strix 750 watt, 80 plus gold, 10 year warranty. And it's most likely um, fully modular. ROG heat sinks, premium components, cosmetic customization, axial tech fan design. So yeah, this thing has all the bells and whistles you could want in a power supply. It's got this like flat box right here. Flat Stanley over here. You know the vibes. That was nice and easy. Oh, this thing kind of has some weight to it. This is from Feezybo. Fe Loki, I don't even know how to say the brand name. But they are sponsoring an up and coming video. And this thing is a little footrest, like a standing, like a standing footboard. Oh, you guys can't even see that. Let me scoot that back. Oh, this thing is, it's kind of comfortable. And it's going to be nice standing up on it, you know. Bet I'm going to sit on it for now. It's a bit more comfortable than the ground. All right. Oh. Maybe not. Why is it so awkward? Okay. We got a big fatty old package right here. It's a fractal PC case. It's a fractal torrent compact in the white colorway. I'm not going to open it up right now. Because once again, up and coming PC build. So I want to save it for that video. But yeah, this is an ATX case. It's one of the new ones from Fractal. And it's going to look so clean. And it's tailored to air cooling. Not air cooling. But it should be tailored to airflow. Should be pretty good for that. And like I said, this brand, Fe Feasibo, they sent me a standing desk. But honestly, I don't want to open it. Eh, I'm sorry. But yeah, I don't want to open this. I am saving it for an up and coming video. So definitely stay tuned for that. Also, sorry for this scuffed video. This one was pretty scuffed. It was more or less a vlog and my vlog style is still kind of out of whack. But if you did enjoy this video, I'd appreciate a like. And I'm also sorry about the lack of consistency on this channel right now. Don't worry, I'm not going anywhere. YouTube isn't going anywhere. Life is just pretty hectic right now. But yeah, if you enjoyed the video, consider smashing a like and watch this video next. And help me get one of my first ever videos to a million views. I'd really appreciate it. Also sub, road to 20K.